Well, he was, what I mean by separate is, remember I just mentioned earlier how, right, some of the most popular movies are mm -hmm. made. Yeah. Right? But you don't see Montu there. Right. Right? You'll look at, I mean, uh, the X-Men. Mm -hmm. Right? We see representations there. Right? You'll see it on in movies. You'll see it, right? Sort of, kind of there, but you're not seeing him directly there. Like, okay, this is Montu right here. This is, right? And you don't see any drawings. I've never seen a movie with a relief of him being there where you walk up and say, oh, that's him. Right? You see other ones. Amon. Right. Everybody wants to do that. Right? Yeah. Okay. So, there's a depiction in... Uh, I want to... What's that movie? Um, uh, was the... Avenger, uh, no, it was... Uh, was I don't remember what movie that was. But anyway, there was doing a, a procession. Uh -huh. And the procession was being led and everybody was bowing before, you know, this, uh, this, this suit or the king as he was coming down the road. And they had th that symbol with the lion on it. Yeah. They had you know, the Huthimus. Yeah. There. And they said, oh, there's the Huthimus right there being, you know, he was making on the relief on this card as they're going down this road. But a person... You know, not realizing the symbolism, it just would have just passed him right by. Yeah, absolutely. Would have known anything about it. But see, I know Tahuti. Yeah. Okay. So that's what that means. So I said, oh, there's Tahuti there. Yeah. He said, well, how do you know? Because as a relief we just see, you'll see him forever and know that's him. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's power so, in that truth. That's right. Yeah, absolutely. So... That's kind of what I wanted to talk about because he is in heavenly in the So um, I wanted to kind of just, you know, uh, get this into the audience's mind on our history is so deep. Uh, it's so important. I just cannot even begin to express uh, the, the validity and the importance of it. Yeah. Well, you notice, uh, you know, recently I, uh, you know, I chopped up one of our other conversations and I kind of focus on on us kind of learning even the greek mythology right because obviously we don't necessarily have strong connections to it or don't think we have strong connections to it right but but so much of that early mythology is rooted in african people yes it is yeah so yeah so um i do want to do one on that yeah so you could be able to see exactly where that is so my goal is to show that the proof is always in the pudding. Yeah, absolutely. So there's no question of what we're looking at. Yeah. You That's know, so absolutely. You know, this is this is pretty mind blowing. Like I've seen this, I've seen this image a lot of times before. I always assumed that it was set, you know, and that imagery had never because we're never really hearing about Montu very much. You really have to go deep to kind of get your references to him and also to be able to read what was actually on the walls. Because that's where yes. we're getting our, you know, information so many 